Hey, what is going on guys? My name is Danny Van Damme and welcome to a brand new w 2 k 17 micro episode. So in the last episode, we went one-on-one -on -one with the United States champion, which is John Cena. And uh, he attacked me before the match and he tried to take with a brown town, which he, you know, he, he got a lot of damage in on me. We started off the match with red health straight off the bat. And uh, we did manage to come back and beat the champ, which is uh, obviously great. Except the disheartening thing about that is we didn't rank up. We're still number three on the contendership for his title. But tonight we go one on one with Baron Blade, and he is number two on the rankings, and we're number three. So if we beat him here tonight, I'm pretty sure we will rank up, which is absolutely amazing. Triple H says, put on a five star match and lose to Baron Blade. That's not going to happen. We're going to win this match, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. So without further ado, let's get straight into main event. Alrighty, so we're here in Baltimore tonight on main event, opening the show against Baron Blade, and uh, we're going to lock up straight off the bat. Now, we've went one-on-one -on -one with him before, I believe, and we got an easy, easy victory, so I'm not too uh, I'm not too scared about this match. Look at this. We're winning him straight off the bat of the lockup, and we actually get the upper hand straight away. That's, this is great. Let's just hit him a bit, tease him. Why not? Get him uh, softened up. There we are. I'm going to just start wrenching on that arm a little bit more, and uh, I don't think he's got a chance. Like, I don't, I don't think he stands a chance at all. Look at that. We win once again. We are really taking control of this match early on. There we are. Just working more on that arm. Now, we will be moving on to the head and start working on the head a little bit in a, in a little bit here. Uh, as per, you know, the, the normal game plan. We're going to hit him with a crossbody, though, taking him out. Uh, sending him to the ground. That's just a uh, ground to opponent. Now, Baron Blade did, did reverse that, I believe. Yep. There we are with a European upper, uppercut. He didn't manage to go to do the ground, but huge spine buster. Crash into the mat, okay. Alright, alright. Let's use a reversal there. Let's get a bit of a combo going. Spin and back kick, but no, Baron Blade reverses. Now, going for some sort of bigger move. What is this? A power bomb, but no, we managed to roll him up. Is this the victory right here? The referee is out of position. One, two, three. <gasps> I thought we had that there. I thought we had that there. That's a two count already. Wow. That would have been like one of the fastest matches in history. Like, who's Goldberg? You know what I mean? Let's just let's just keep on chopping them and a woo in the corner, if you know what I'm saying. Hit him with that double leg drop kick, and uh, let's just get a taunt off. You know, why not? He's he's grounded. We may as well get that extra extra boost towards our finisher. And uh, yeah, let's uh, you know what? Let's throw him off the ropes and hit him with a super kick to start working on the head. Boom! Just like that, Baron Blade doesn't stand a chance. Jarvis knows Baron Blade's tattoos are really shit. <laughs> They're really bad. Uh, right, so, okay, okay, Baron Blade fighting back, but just like that, we are uh, swinging momentum back in our favor, fav favor, favor, I mean favor, <laughs> alright, so let's, uh, let's start working on the head, we've almost got a signature already, wow, we are destroying Baron Blade, as I say that he gets a reversal in, that's fine, no, that's fine, some sort of Michinoku driver, oh, okay, okay, showing a little bit of strength right there, now taunting of his own, okay, alright, right, get the hell out of here, that's a hit with signature straight off the bat. Pele kick working on that face of uh, Baron Blade. He's in a bad, bad position here. That's right. We're using my head. I'm still digging this attire. I really like it. Right. Let's hit him with that uh, Shining Wizard. Uh, right there. That looks like more of a Pele kick, but it is a Shining Wizard, I believe. Um, let's take him to the top rope, actually. I know that I said I wanted to work on his head, but at the same time, I don't know. I kind of just want to suplex him on one of ours or Horikarana. Okay, okay. Baron Blade reversing. And ooh, he hits with a blockbuster. Nice. He's going, he's going for a pinfall. All right. Get the hell out of here. Not even a one count for him. Not even a one count for Mr. Baron Blade. What are you doing? Okay, okay. Go for a suplex. All right, so Baron Blade is starting to build a little bit of momentum in this match. I'm still, uh, wait, he's coming to a feet? No, he's not. This is an old taunt. Okay, okay. Get the hell out of here. Okay, we missed the Pele kick. Oh my gosh. All right, it's some sort of angle slam. Wait, what? What was that? He's got a signal. I don't have a reversal, by the way. All right, okay. Shades of uh, Dusty Rhodes over here. We did roll out, and we just no sword them, though. So that's, that's great, that's great. Baron Blade. All right, let's see if we can grab him. Oh, let's start working on that head. Hit him once. Jump through the second rope. Hit him with that DDT. Um, just softening up his face for that uh, running knee. All right, it's going to let us do me. No, it's not. No, it's not. Baron Blade. Baron Blade. Wait, what? Uh, ooh, oh my gosh. Okay, Baron Blade is pulling out some good moves in this match. By the way, I went for my finisher there. And I uh, didn't register. Okay, okay. Easy kickouts. Easy kickouts today. Easy kickouts. 
Oh my gosh, he missed that move. The plonker. That's right, I'll just call them a plonker. Get over it. Let's just start working on that face even more. Baron Blade using, using his last reversal. But uh, we're in a bad position. We don't have any reversals. Oh, okay, okay. He's starting to work on that uh, that upper back to head region as well. I don't know what his finisher is, so we could get caught off guard. Hmm, we'll see, we'll see. Alright, alright, so this is some sort of power slam again. Alright, Baron Blade uh, gaining some momentum. Gaining a lot of momentum, actually. Thinking about it. Okay, what was that? That's what we're going for, that's what we're going for. Right, we've got another signature, which is the Death Valley Driver, the Pele Kick. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, what? Wait, what? How did he hit that? I was I was walking away. Huge power bomb by Baron Blade, though. He's going to drag it to the center of the ring. All right. Okay, we kicked out. I was scared. I was scared there. Um, I really wanted to kick out. <laughs> All right, Baron Blade is firing up. Baron Blade is firing up. All right, but we do manage to reverse that. With a European up, I cut. And then we're hitting with the knee. No, we don't. No, we don't. Okay, we're out of here. We're out of here. No, we're not. No, we're not. Oh, no. We are in a bad, bad position, people. We are in a bad, bad position. If he hits with this finisher, we're done But Charlotte, but Charlotte is doing what I paid her to do, which is distract uh, Baron Blade and help her with her matches. Now, I think the best thing we can do in this situation is just get out of the ring. That's what I think. I think that's the best situation get out and get it torn off you know just so we'll build the momentum a little bit faster we've currently got a signature but uh you know i really want to build that finisher hit it with a snap suplex on the outside which is very very good hmm. maybe right maybe baron blade is a little bit hungry maybe he's a little bit okay he's not hungry he doesn't want to eat the announce table get the hell out of here all right so he's got one reversal but we're gonna try and hit where we're running knee anyways and we hit him we hit him in the center of the ring with the knee that should be all she wrote one two three just like that one knee to put away baron blade now hopefully that's us ranking up hopefully that's our uh, fingers crossed anyways best case scenario wow he was he was a bit of a little a little bastard wasn't he he was he was sneaky he was sneaky with his reversals and his moves uh maybe i should have saved reversals in that match, except, you know, nevertheless, we still got the win. Yeah, okay, okay, right. Triple H isn't like, well, that's fine, that's fine. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you when we get back to the, uh, the other screen. Uh, we'll see if, um, if we've ranked up. Alrighty, so we didn't actually rank up off that, which is, uh, very disappointing, but we have got, uh, one-on-one -on -one with Big Show on SmackDown, which is a little bit intimidating. Um, a rival, ooh, we've got a rival promo as well, okay. All right. Okay, so without further ado, let's, uh, I think it's a promo first, so let's get straight into this promo, and, uh, let's see how this goes. Alrighty, so the good guy, John Cena, is here, making his way into the ring, let's see what he's got to say about what. Yay, go on, yay, the crowd is behind you, as always, the franchise player, John Cena, making his way inside of the ring. Alright, let's, oh no, I'm gonna skip that, I just don't wanna say it, there we are, okay, so, let's see what he has to say. Alright. When I come out here, I bask in the energy that flows through the thousands of people that surround me. However, there's something amiss tonight. Something eating away at every single superstar backstage. Fear. Okay, okay. I could just run in. So if I press X, I can just run in. I kind of want to see what he has to say first and then run in a bit. So uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see where he goes with this. We'll see where he goes with this. I have to tell you, I haven't been sleeping well these, these uh, last few weeks leading up to tonight. I've had a lot on my mind. Part of me wasn't even sure I'd come out here at night. And let me tell you why. Okay, okay. I'm uh, I'm intrigued. This promo is pretty good so far. Let's uh let's see what he has to say. Everybody from Little Rock, uh, something in London, um, England knows what match I want. So it's about time the match is made. We've been crossing paths more. Uh, hopefully talking about me more than we've uh, wanted. But I think that's fate's way of telling us what needs to happen. So let's ignore. Let's stop ignoring fate and let's do the thing. Tonight, I'm asking no. I'm demanding that the authority give me the opportunity to settle my rivalries once and for all. Hopefully, this means a match with me for the United States Championship that we've been grinding for. For those of you who don't think I deserve it, I'll prove it to you next time I compete in this ring. And the time after that, and the time after that, and the time after that. Uh, you get the point. 
That's what I've been doing since I've been in the WWE, and that's what I'll continue to do. But for the authority, if you don't give me what I want, then Triple H is going to have, have a thorn in his side for a very long time. And this time, it won't be called Stephanie. Ooh, shots fired, right? I, I think he's talking about the WWE Championship. That he wants to shot at the WWE Championship. Now, I want to shot at his title, so what the hell? It's time for me to take things to the next level. It's time for me to take the WWE and break the whole thing wide open. So you'd all better br brace yourselves. Things are about to get real. If you're not ready for the for the ride, you better get off now. So all right, so we can't. Okay. So it didn't uh, it didn't let with break in uh, run in again at the end. Maybe you should have run a little bit sooner. Except nevertheless, it's uh it's good to see what he had to say. So maybe he's talking about the WWE Championship. I'm, at the beginning, I thought that he was talking about the match with me. Except, you know, I don't know, I don't know. We'll, we'll see where that rivalry goes. This rivalry is interesting so far. Uh, I mean, I wish I could have run in on that. Except, nevertheless, now we go one-on-one -on -one with Big Show. And, uh, yeah, let's see what happens there. It's the Big Show. It's the big jobber. The big guy who loses in every match. <laughs> the, the big show, and I have the bigger punch that knocks you out there on the choke slammer. Okay, I don't know what that was. So let's get straight into this match, anyways. Uh, that kind of sounded like Arnold Schwarzenegger more than Big Show, but whatever, whatever. We will not be intimidated by this big potato, bald headed guy. <laughs> okay, Shawn Michaels. Shawn Michaels is inside of uh, Big Show's body. Oh my gosh, okay, okay. Calm down. Calm down, Big Show. Calm down, Big Show. Get the head off us. You will fall just like everyone else. Okay, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. Big Show has uh, shown a lot of strength. Yeah, let's hit him. <gasps> okay, okay, okay. Maybe not. Maybe not. All right, all right. Big Show is he's very, very dominant. Uh, I think we've went against Big Show once before. Well, we didn't lose. We won, except it was a very close match. Charlotte distracted Big Show, which is exactly what I need. Oh, huge neck break. I worked on that head already. Um, maybe we'll have to go for the elbow drop in this match, actually, because... Uh, I don't really see we're hitting the running knee, to be honest with you. I don't know why, but, you know. It's him with a spin and back kick, nevertheless. And now... Okay, I just failed that, that crossbody. I really need to take that off. That running crossbody's been causing me problems for so many matches. There we are. That knee. Okay, okay. Big shot. Big Show using his strength to his advantage. Huge Irish Irish whip. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. Bit of wings have changed right there. Let's just rake to the eyes. Let's play a little bit dirty. But Big Show once again. On the offensive. Look at this guy go. Okay. This is a... Uh, mm, Alright. This is actually quite hard. Are you going to go for the pin off that? Not today though. Not today. Charlotte believes in my kick out ability. She didn't interrupt there. Maybe we might we might need to get quite dirty in this match. We might need to uh, take off the turnbuckles and all that good stuff because I'm not too sure if we can do this clean. Why do they use two reversals? Come on, let's just hit a move. Okay, and the strength once again coming into. All right. Charlotte has uh, put in a chair. Maybe we're going to have to use that because, honestly, I don't know if I can beat Big Show. Maybe we just need to get ourselves disqualified. Going to go for another pin. Big Show. Not even close. Or not even close. We kick out. I'm not even one. Well, once again, just wearing my body down. Big Show is... Uh, he's definitely the dominant, ma uh, the dominant man in this match. We finally have a comeback, though. Big Show getting out of the ring. Get inside, get inside, get inside. There we are. Wait, what? Wait, what? Did that seriously not let us hit me come back? Okay. Okay, and anyways, we hit a forearm. That's weird. That's weird. I hit the forearm for me come back. Yeah, it didn't. It didn't actually proc the comeback. Alright, that's a little bit bullshit. Not gonna lie. I feel as if I've been screwed a bit, but that's fine. That's fine. Nevertheless, we've got a signature now. Right, have we got time to go over here and take off this turn book? I think we do. There we are, there we are. Oh, uh, oh, that's right. What's what's wrong? What's wrong, buddy? Yeah? What's wrong? Your back hurting? Huh? Is your back hurting? I'm sorry. Go on then. You want it again? Ooh. 
Yum. Yum, yum, yum. Is that even hurting him? I don't even know if that's hurting him. Whatever. We're going to go under. And we're going to come back over with that pele kick. Starting to work on Big Show's face. Or his head. Whatever. Uh, I am still scared. I am still very scared. This can change in an instance. Mm, let's try and a strong grapple action. I haven't tried one of these. Huge DDT planned on Big Show on his big baldy head. His nice shiny dome. Hmm. Come and hit like a, a drop kick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we can. Boom. Just like that. Wearing down the big man. Now it quickly getting it torn off. Hmm. Okay. Okay. He just seems to reverse everything. He's only got three reversals though. So if we can. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh my. What do you reverse my reversal? Sorry guys, I've still got a bad throat, so uh, that's why I haven't really been uploading much. But uh, yeah, I'll show you guys, you can understand. I'm trying to do what I can for you here. Oh my gosh, he can't hit the head, but I don't know why. Okay, he finally hits it. What? I super kicked him there. I super kicked him there. Bullshit. Can we roll out? Yes, we can. There we are. Your legs are a bit too big, mate. Yeah, can we grab him? No, no, let's, let's wait till he turns around. And we'll try and hit him with that DDT inside of the ring. That will, uh, will hit like nearly every match. There we are. I believe we've just hit the DDT. Boom. Nice, nice. Okay, so he has a finisher. You know what? We're going to go for a pin off that. Let's see if he can, let's see if we can get him to use his uh, finisher to kick out. Like use that as resiliency. Only a one cut on the big show. He's looking strong. Hmm. I don't want to say he's harder than John Cena, except he is pretty difficult. Uh, he's a lot more difficult than I originally thought. Let's even hit with a super kick. And we did. That's great, that's great. The thing is, I'm a bit weary at uh, going to the top rope to try and hit the elbow drop because he's got a finisher. And uh, he's probably just going to knock out Punchra and then we're done deal. So, yeah. Alright, alright. What is this? What is this? No, not a huge power stamp. <gasps> Shades of British Bulldog. Oh no, don't call for it. Charlotte, we need your help more than ever. <gasps> oh my, that was lethal. That was absolutely lethal. Charlotte, what are you doing? <gasps> my god, only a one count. Only a one count. We are going off. We are going off. Pew, 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 pew. Shots fired. That was a, that was a really easy kick out, actually. <laughs> okay, okay. Alright. I'm uh, down with this. Big Show has put me through a paces though. Wow, he has definitely put me through a paces. And he's almost all, already got another signature. Wow, okay, we managed to get a reversal anyways. Managed to get a reversal. And the big guy has been bust open. The big guy has been bust open. Get the hell of the mat. One. Two. Ooh, I actually thought that. I thought that was a three. I thought that was a three. Let's quickly get a, a torn off just to build another finisher. Okay, okay. This match is starting to get really intense. Oh, what? Wait, what? Hey, what? How did he reach me there? He's using hacks. He's using hacks. Oh my gosh, he's won. He's won. There's no way I'm kicking out of this. There's no way I'm kicking out of this. Wow. Oh, let it be. Woohoo! Let it be. The holy Jesus, which is Danny Van Dam, is here, the king of kickouts. Woo! I am on point. I am on point today. I just seem to be getting better and better, to be honest with you. Okay, I've just been here with a knockout punch. Maybe I'm not getting better and better. Maybe it was all a lie. Okay, we're going to use resiliency right there to get that shoulder up. There's nothing else we could do because Charlotte wasn't helping. I don't, know what, I don't know what she was doing, but whatever. Okay, we managed to get a reversal off. Oh, huge Hurricanrana. Let's just quickly get a taunt behind him. This is our turn now to be a longer match than I anticipated. That's fine, though, that's fine. Let's just keep on stomping away until he uses the reversal. And he gets up. Hit him with that knee. Hit him with that knee. Hook the leg. One, two, three. Three, just like that, we we demolish. Well, not demolish. Let's be real. Let's be real. He pretty much demolished us all that much. That was a very very lucky win. But we did endure 
the damage. We did endure the pain that he put us through. And uh, we managed to get the pinfall. And that's what champions are. Champions are made from getting beat down and then coming back and still winning no matter what. This is championship material right here. So uh, give us a title shot, John. There we are. He has your winner, Danny Van Diver. Let's see. Ooh, win by pinfall. Triple H is happy. Jobs are good in. Let's see who we're going against next episode. Alrighty, so the next match on main event, we're going to be going one-on-one -on -one with Dolph Ziggler. Now, we've had a past rivalry, and uh, things are quite heated between us, except we did get the upper hand nearly every match. Uh, we didn't rank up, but uh, I wasn't really expecting to, if I'm honest with you. I mean, we've only beaten Big Show, and he's not really high on the rankings. Uh, we're still kind of just hoping that the rivalry brings with some sort of title match against John Cena at the next pay-per-view. Alrighty, so if you did enjoy this episode, make sure you hit the like button down below as it helps the video and the channel grow a hell of a lot more than you'd actually think. And uh, if you want to see more W2K17 my career content in the future, make sure you hit, hit that subscribe button. And uh, yeah, my name's been Danny Van Damme. I hope you guys have a fantastic day, and I will see you all in the next episode. Okay, goodbye.